All right, so welcome back to the channel. My name's Kevin. I'm Tarsha. And this is Conversations with the Crawleys. And on this channel, we do a lot of conversations about faith, family, relationships. And we do recaps, reviews, and commentary on some of our favorite shows. This is, y'all been waiting for it. Y'all been looking forward mm, to it. Mm, mm, mm. This is our predictions on what's going to happen on the finale of Ready to Love Miami. So, this is content that you enjoy. You already know what to do. You're hitting that subscribe. You're hitting the like. You're requesting notifications. You're sharing? And you're becoming a member and checking out the merch store. Look at you. Look at y'all. Y'all doing good. Excellent. Ha <laughs> ha. Good job, y'all. Kudos. <laughs> All right. So, listen, we were about to get into it. We were like, nah, let's we just We started talking. We was like, okay, who left? Who are we talking about? So, let's go down who we got left. All right. So, on the guy's side, we got Mike. Mike. We got Randall. Ray Ray. And we got... <laughs> ra 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 ra. And we got Swayze. And we got Swayze. So, we only got three guys left. Okay. Okay. On the lady side, we mm -hmm. have Brandy. Brandy. Kayla. Kayla. Jamala. Jamala. Kadian. Kadian. And technically. Technically. Sharice. Oh, yeah, technically, yeah, yeah. Sharice. Technically, correct. 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 So. We're not. Got, well, let's start with her. Let, go ahead. So. You're saying she's going to bow out. I'm saying she should have been gone week two. Okay. Well, past that. You thinking she's going to bow out? I'm thinking that she won't show up. With no no show, no call to Uncle Tommy. And then say that Uncle Tommy's attacking her and <laughs> being aggressive up. by calling Shut her up. and asking for a meeting. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah. But, okay. Or she's going to show up, say Tommy, because you got to make your, your ending scene. You still get to be on TV. You know... I tried, and he had to determine he is just not ready to love. Or she gonna make a play for Swayze that way she can go against Katie and no, she she ain't, she ain't gonna do that. She ain't gonna do that. She don't so, want that smoke. No. She don't want that smoke. Well, well, she don't want that. So okay, that's her. Yeah, that's her. And then I was talking about Mike. I was like, well, Mike already made his choice, which I think is Brandy. But you said. Now, long, I do think that Mike will choose Brandy. Mm -hmm. But the way Mike has been moving, Mike has not officially really made his choice. Mike is still wavering between two opinions. Hmm. How long <laughs> will you waver? <laughs> <laughs> well, so, and so the question is. Question is. Listen, yeah, listen, we going to put a bunch of, y'all going to see a bunch of music titles rolling through. Shout out to the Winans. <laughs> but it's it's a question of, is Brandy willing to put up with this? And is Kayla willing to put up with it? Because here's the thing. Well, Kayla hasn't been really putting up with it. She's been speaking her piece more than I feel Brandy has. At least what we've been seeing on Yes video. and no. Hmm. Yes and no. I say that because... I think that Kayla, here's the thing. I think that, and this is this is a man speaking. So, ladies, y'all tell me if I'm, if I'm out of pocket, if I'm wrong. I'll do it. I know you will. <laughs> but if, if the man can't make up his mind, hmm. the woman, in my opinion, sees that and will make up, th make up his mind for him. And why and, can't the man make up his mind Let's, since you're giving the man's perspective? I'm just simply, I don't know why he can't make up his mind. What in because, general because he has, can make up his mind? Well, for, I mean, he's kind of alluded to it, right? He said that he, uh, that she's kind of his, Kayla kind of his video vixen, mm -hmm. his fantasy, mm -hmm. and Brandy's more his reality, right? Mm -hmm. So he's trying to figure out if he can have his cake and eat it too. Okay. He's trying to figure out if he's, if he's qualified, again, putting, trying to figure out his mindset. Is he qualified to go for his fantasy or mm. is he just going to stick with what he feels he deserves or can get or what have you? Mm. That's the way Mike's thinking. Okay. I Now, I feel that Kayla's been more expressive because she's she's mentioned, she said out loud, like, okay, so... She has been. You know, like, when are you going to make a decision? Why haven't you... I know him better than him. You know, like, so it's like... We're playing this game, but I'm being very 
she's saying one thing like, hey, you need to make a decision. Is it going to be me or, you know, me or Brandy? Do you want him or do you want me? Because I want you. <laughs> Shout out to the late, great Prince. <laughs> so, but then internally is this fight with her about who, you know, because her friend was saying that Randall was more the guy she should have been going for and putting more her energy there. You know, but we're finding out that Randall has a hard time choosing too. Well, Jamala making him choose. He said Jam- <laughs> Jamala like you and, and her whole family. <laughs> you should be putting her to the curb. <laughs> so I think what I'm what I I think for Kayla, I think I'm I think Kayla you think Kayla's not going to end up with anybody? I don't think she's ending up with anybody. I think that that's I think that's pretty much been decided. Mm. I think it's been interesting. I'll say interesting. There's other words I can use, but it's been interesting mm. to watch Kayla be essentially some s- secondary second choice, yeah, second and third choice, really, yeah, and her seem to be not in some respects okay with it. I say he's okay with it because. I, I I just can't see. I I just don't understand. If you were, let's say, go back to your dating days, twenty six plus years ago, right? If there was a guy that you was feeling, and mm-hmm. you knew that he was feeling somebody else, mm-hmm. right? You guys are trying to check things out, but mm-hmm. he keeps waffling back and forth. Mm-hmm. At some point, and wouldn't you be like, you know what? You go with what you, you, you're confused about, and I'm going to move on. Mm-hmm. That's kind of what I'm expecting from Kayla. I'm expecting Kayla to, to by this point, be like, you know what? Stop creeping around. Stop coming and talking to me after Brandy has left the, the set. Mm-hmm. It's done. I, I, I'll make the decision for you. That's kind of what I've been expecting for mm-hmm. Kayla, but I haven't seen that. Yeah, because I, I get the sense, right? We can't read their minds. Right. We know that some of the video is cut. Absolutely. But I, I keep getting the sense. She's like, I want someone just to choose me. Mm-hmm. And maybe this is not the setting to be the choice. Right. Does that make sense? Yeah. And so I feel like I will always want to feel like I have the power. And in some respects, she's allowing them to have the power. Exactly. And in me being the woman, if I'm not being chosen or feeling like I'm being put as the priority, mm-hmm. Like you, I'm like you know what, peace. I can be just dating, be back on these dating streets. I can do bad all by myself, <laughs> right? Yep. And just kind of move on instead of this um, um, emotional, you know, roller coaster. On an emotional roller coaster. <laughs> so, um, yeah, because I think when I think even if you're, because you know, Mike keeps saying, well. She doesn't seem needy, but I feel like there's a difference in feeling needy and saying I'm important. Right. So Mm -hmm. if Mike is saying, okay, she allowed me to just do what I need to do, but a woman needs to feel important. Yep. And I don't think she's expressing that part. I agree. So, okay. And that's, that's what for me is interesting just because of how Kayla comes off. Mm Mm-hmm. The impression I get from her mm-hmm. and what we're seeing as far as portrayed, I don't mm-hmm. see the, 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 I don't, there's a conflict there, if you will. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, so we kind of brought him up. Randall. Randall. And Jamala. Mm-hmm. Or Kayla. Mm-hmm. I think he's going to choose Jamala. I think so too. Um, Cause we feel like they're already in a relationship. <laughs> Because she given these vibes of... I'm in a relationship. Yeah. And when you get close to this point, I think, granted, you know, you've been dating this person. Mm-hmm. And if you've been in close contact in a lot of the deep conversations, mm-hmm. that's the position I would want a confident woman to take. Right. In saying, this is why I feel like, you know... Um, he's mine or whatever. Right. Because like they were in the lounge last week and she makes some comment, you know, to her about it's work. It's something smart. Mm-hmm. And like this side comment and it was like, okay. Yeah. 
So again, she's giving the vibes like I'm already in relationship. Yeah. I'm just playing this to the end. Yeah. So just to recap, we we both believe that Mike will choose Brandy. Correct. Um, we both believe that Randall will choose Jamala. Yes. And I think the world knows that Katie and, and Swayze choose each other. It, well, they've already... The prediction of that, we don't even have to predict based off of what we're seeing, on right? Yeah. On Instagram. But they feel like they're going to work through their situation mm-hmm. because there's a, a good connection there. And we'll see. Yeah. Now, the question, how long is that going, relationship going to last? Yeah. Because I know she was looking for some definites about, mm-hmm. you know, what kind of relationship this is going to be. Yeah. So this way, he give her that information? Are we going to see that in the reunion? Possible. I hope so. You know, if she got some definites or is she just finally just saying, I'm going to relax. And we're just going to go with how this goes and see where it leads. No, I don't think she <laughs> <laughs> Nope. Nope. <laughs> She's not doing that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Katie is uh, just going to go with the flow. No, no. <laughs> I think she's real serious about um, being in a serious relationship. Intentional. She's yes. being intentional. Yes. And, and she's going to put Swayze in a headlock to get it intentional. <laughs> yeah, I could see that. <laughs> now that I could see. <laughs> uh, so I think that's, that's the couples. Mm-hmm. So Kayla will be left out in the cold. Um, no, there's some warm streets out well, in mean, Florida yes, and Miami. Miami. Oh, <laughs> so, so, again, I think, if anything, it could be an experience. Mm-hmm. You know, okay, what does she learn about herself? You know, how does she feel about going forward? And, and then there's always the reunion. So, we'll, we'll once see. we see the reunion trailer, you know we'll give you our, our, our opinion on what's happening there, too. Cause yeah, because, you know, one season, one went from one to the other. Yeah. They picked one person, but they ended and up with somebody else. And all of a sudden, he got up off that couch and went onto the other couch. So, so that would be so interesting. We'll see. <laughs> if Mike if Mike get up from one couch and go to the other couch. Or he had her stand Randall, up again. And then him and Randall fighting over that couch. <laughs> I think Mike could take Randall. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. He'll remove him. <laughs> Pick him up like he's an appliance. Yeah. All right. Hmm. So I think that's it. Make sure you make sure you're hitting that subscribe, liking, and yes. request notifications. Tell so us you your can comments. be here for the finale. Who do you think's gonna yeah. end up together? Let us know your thoughts. Um, and then check out the other videos we have, of course, and we will see you next time. Have a great one. Be blessed. Bye.